Who's here? Ball and Skull. Hi, girls. How about that double date we talked about? Yeah. <laughs> what about? Sorry, guys. What's the matter? We're not good enough for you? Leave us alone, Bulk. Oh, yeah. Make me. Yeah. Make me. <laughs> him. Thank him. Hey, you heard what she said. Oh, what do you know? The dancer wants to be a fighter. It's okay, Zach. We can handle these two. Oh, really? Let's show him some karate moves, Skull. You guys should definitely join Jason's karate class. <laughs> nah, the circus don't take geek clowns. <laughs> not geek clowns, that's great. That is so fun. Why don't you guys just crawl back to the ooze you came from? Oh, that's funny. Especially coming from a friend of the monkey man here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? We still can make it all the way to the top. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You saying the folk can't do it? <laughs> yeah, that's what you're saying, all right. Step aside. Let me show you how it's done. Are you sure you know how to work this thing? Well, what do you think I am? Stupid? Well, you know what they say. If the rope fits, climb it! <laughs> hey, Boke, I thought you were going up. <laughs> showed us this time, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> Show them. Famous Earth. Recycle that. Get a life bulk. Hey, why don't you take this to the dump with you, Miss Clean? <laughs> hey, geek. Come on, let me go. You finally flipped over me. Come on, let's get her. <laughs> well, it looks like it's time to take out the trash <laughs> and deliver these petitions. <laughs> Bye. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Hi, Pinhead. I heard you chokes today. <laughs> the bench press record's still mine. <laughs> you two are a bad dream. Let them go, Bulk. Hey, I got this. Oh, oh, you're tough. You're a man. You're so tough, I'm shaking. <laughs> hey, Bulk. You take this? Spy shop man, you know it, it measures high energy levels like a like a radar detector. The power ranger's got to be loaded with energy, and this thing is gonna help us find them. <gasps> Bulky, it's beeping like crazy. The power rangers have got to be. 
me around here. Gather around, everyone! We are about to find out who the Power Rangers really are! Huh? Huh? Ernie? Come <laughs> I hope you guys didn't spend a lot of money on that thing. Well, that's what those two clowns back at the juice bar said. I don't know. I certainly don't see any Power Rangers around here. Maybe we should go. Did somebody mention the Power Rangers? You're the Power Ranger. In living spandex. Uh, wait a minute. Where are the other Power Rangers? They're all, po they're all polishing their swords. Wait. Just bought a giant, huge creature thing. Uh-huh. Come on, let's get out of here. No, wait! Don't you want to see us, uh, you know, riding our swords? Yeah! We really are the Power Rangers! Did someone huh? mention Power Rangers? <laughs> if you're the Power Rangers, why don't you do something? <laughs> I'm going to destroy the Power Rangers! <laughs> Come back and fight! <laughs> oh, I feel great! Oh, 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 hey, we're not the Power Rangers. Don't hurt us! No, we are not the Power Rangers! <laughs> Here we go. Come on, Skull. Duty calls. Uh, excuse me, sir. Can you tell us where the registration office is? You boys looking to enroll in the junior police patrol? Yeah, you're looking at two of Angel Grove's finest future detectives. We want to wear uniforms so we can impress the girls. <laughs> you better have a better reason than that. That wasn't meant to sound the way it sounded. We want to protect the girls. That's better. Straight ahead, you can't miss it. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Gee, bulky people sure do like to run around here. Hey, where do you think you are going, sweet boy? All right, remember, people, to be invited to be part of Angel Grove's Junior Police Patrol, you must be in tip-top physical condition. <laughs> Change my mind, Bulky. I'm not the physical type. Huh? No muscle and proud of it. That's me. <laughs> you will do it, and you will like it. Come on, the Bulky, the Bulky. I hate it. I about the cutest thing that I have ever seen. Uh-huh. <sighs> Has anyone ever told you that you have the most beautiful eyes? Mm, no, not recently. <sighs> Listen, handsome, uh, you got a date for the ball? Uh, <laughs> no, now that you mention it, no. <laughs> Kimberly, what's going on? I thought we were gonna go to the ball. Mm. No way. You've got the best, so I settle for the rest. Please, please, please stop 
office. All this holiday spirit is giving me a big headache. That's so bulk. It's the best assignment Lieutenant Stone's ever given us. We get to do our community service training at a party. Ha! You're not the one who has to play Santa Claus. Ho, ho, ho for a bunch of drooling children. <laughs> yes! Cassidy. Cassidy Cornell. Dr. Oliver, as you may know, I'm the anchor and field reporter for our school TV station. <laughs> anyway, I'm sure our viewers are wondering, well, you don't really look old enough to be a teacher. Devin, are you getting this? Cassidy, I promise you, I'm old enough. So let's put the camera away. You missed it. For now, let's talk about you guys and what you expect of yourselves in this class, because that's what's really important. Is uh, someone missing? Side reporter. Anyway, I'm here to do a story on how you went from struggling nobody to pop superstar. <laughs> Aren't you kind? <laughs> well, you know, it all started. I... Oh, hold on. Kira, I'm so sorry, duty calls. Can we catch up later? You're awesome. Devin, you simply must find a way from this wretched place. Your queen is not amused. And you know what happens when we are not amused? But wait, Cass, I, I mean, I kind of don't get something here. Wasn't Guinevere, like, you know, really nice? Hello, I'm taking her a different way. <laughs> oh, right. Whoa! Yes! <laughs> Waiter! What? You do what you gotta do. Waiter, hello! I'll find something to keep me busy until you get a break. That'll be great. Waiter, hello! Yeah, Cass, look, I don't think they really like the whole mm, clicky thing. Well, you see, my, my brother, he's a waiter and... Save it for your memoirs, Devin. Every mm. second my decaf latte sits at the bar, it loses foam, and I hate it when they lose foam. There you go, one decaf latte. Oh, thanks. You know, doing this government in action project has left me totally parched. That's nice. Hey, look, Trent, brother. Yo. Uh, look, I hate to be real drag, but you know, yo. Ah, oh, man, your smoothie. Sorry, Dev. I'll be right back. Thanks, Trent. Whatever. <laughs> Did you hear that? Um, yeah, it'd be hard not to. <laughs> Make it stop! <laughs> Having fun? Uh, yeah, I am. All right, there's only so much you can learn in the classroom. Who's ready for some field work? Let's go. Dr. Oliver, may we have permission to film today's Dig for Journalism class? It's just that I think it will be good for my career if I start focusing on more exciting things like nature and science. But Cass, I thought you said this stuff was as dull as dirt. Uh, actually, Devin, I think I was talking about our last conversation. <laughs> Relax, Cassidy. You could film the Dig. <laughs> huh? Dr. Oliver? Principal Randall? Are you in a play? No. I'm here to join you on your field trip. I didn't realize you were interested in dinosaur bones. Mm, you'd be surprised at what interests me. Yeah, uh, probably would. Shall we? Yeah, the bus is right outside. You can dazzle me with fascinating fossil facts on the way. Look what I found. This is a trilobite. It's from the Paleozoic era, which makes it about 300 million years old. Hmm. Amazing. Well, it doesn't look a day over 200 million. <laughs> Here. Thank you. My pleasure. Come on, little flower. Open up, open up. Did you just see that? <laughs> Principal Randall is totally into Dr. Oliver. What? Over there. Huh? Okay, it's okay. It's okay. I got it. I got it. Thank you. No way, Randall. Love is right in front of your eyes, and you don't even see it. Well, to be honest, Cass, I don't even think that Randall is capable of that emotion. Well, that makes an even better story, doesn't it? This is going to be great for the gossip report. Yeah. But what about my time-lapse flower shot? Oh. There. Hey! Now it's laps for sure. My flower. Come on, Devin. Oh. Just think of the headline. The Randall scandal. Whoa, that's brilliant. Hey, you guys! We need something big 
and something fresh. Ooh, I got it. Check this out. Woman in Iowa raises a 250-pound pumpkin. Well, Cass, you gotta admit, it's fresh and it's really big. Oh. <gasps> Nikki Valentina! Oh, yeah, right, Cass. Like the biggest TV star in the world is gonna come. Here. Hey! Isn't that the girl from Ocean Alert? The most popular television show of all time? Does anyone have a brown paper bag? I'm hyperventilating. Welcome to Haley's Cyberspace. What can I get you? I'm just dying for a wheatgrass shake with a twist of lemon. Oh, sorry. We just ran out of wheatgrass? How about a banana berry smoothie? Did I ask for a smoothie? I'm fairly certain I asked for a wheatgrass shake. And as I said, we... All right. I'll give you $100 for it. I'm sorry. <laughs> you can't buy what I don't have. Listen, I don't know if you noticed this, but I'm Nikki Valentina. There's nothing I can't buy. <laughs> Never mind. I'm over this place. Miss oh. Valentina, Cassidy Cornell, Reefside Reporter. I'm a huge fan. Of course you are. Someday I'm going to be a big star, too, except I'm going to be a news anchor, but, like, maybe we could work together. <laughs> I know. I could be an ocean alert. <laughs> Honey, you better get yourself a new dream, because being me, well, that's mine. And I'm not sharing. Let's go. <laughs> I could be you. I could totally be you, and I'm going to prove it. Heart, Nikki. <laughs> I have to meet her or my life will never be complete. Come, 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 come. I got a big assignment for you. You do? Me? Are you sure? Don't look so surprised. Yeah, you don't want him to change his mind. Look, my field report is out and there's an attack downtown. I need ranger footage for my lead story. Think you and Darwin can handle it? You mean Devin. Yeah, 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 whatever. Just get over there. Right, I'll get right over there. Thank you so much, Mr. Cormier. You won't regret it. I think it's a little late for that. Isn't this exciting? A real protest in our own backyard. Yeah, and for such a great cause. Cause mods, I just want to make the news. Come on, guys, excuse me, you're blocking my light. <laughs> Cassidy, this is no place for posers. Hey. If you're not here for the tree, then move on. Whatever, I'll just give my publicity to someone who appreciates it. Devin, come on. That's it, guys, tie me in real good. This is a symbol of my bond with nature. Oh. Dude, there's something so wrong about this. You know you don't care about this tree. She doesn't need to know. I just have to make it look like I care. Just as I thought. You can't teach an old jock new tricks. Look, do us a favor and leave this to the people who really care. Ooh. Ouch. Help look the way. I got my orders. I'm not moving. Oh, I can't stand teenagers. Trista! Look out! You okay? Yeah, how'd you? I guess it's part of being an old jock. I think we need to talk before someone really gets hurt. We'll talk. There is nothing you can say that will make me change my mind, but. We'll have a chat. Then we'll resume this tomorrow. Everybody out of here! Go on, shoot! Hey, hey guys, I, I'm still, like, a little bit tied up over here. Hey, 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 don't go! Don't go, help, help me over here! I mean, why we're jogging again? Because exercise sharpens a samurai's mind and keeps us more alert! And aware of what's around us. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sherry 
is a part of being a samurai. the serious stuff with a little fun. Uh-huh. <laughs> Stop laughing at me. <laughs> Sure, so he's kind of <laughs> Samurai wannabes! <laughs> you guys are jokes! <laughs> You're wearing underwear, right? of a samurai in full armor or a sandcastle with a real moat. I'm stuck! No! I'm stuck! Tate on the image of your samurai sword, cutting through injustice as easily as a knife slices into cake. <laughs> what kind of frosting? I like vanilla! <laughs> Monsters! No, not monsters. Cake. No, monsters! We're too late. Bummer. Huge bummer. So do you think there's any leftover cake? to face his fear, Spike. Nature is our friend. But I'm scared of bears. I don't think bears live in this neck of the woods. <laughs> Lose the bear spray. What you should have brought is this. Mosquito repellent. Me too. <laughs> Terrified screams of hikers can only mean one thing, Spike! Mosquitoes! Bears! I can't see anything! We gotta run! <laughs> Never run from a bear this close, Spike. Play dead like a possum. <laughs> you can't fool me. Even possums aren't that. <laughs> uh huh.
almost met her. Hey, sleepyhead. About time you woke up, I'm making... <laughs> Smoothies. <laughs> you know what, Spike? <laughs> we gotta get out in the field. We've had too much training and not enough doing. You're right! We gotta get out there. Tackle real problems. Help real people. That's what true samurai do. Ready, Uncle Book! Spike, samurai rule number one. Pack light. Maybe... Maybe we can start by helping me. Uh. All righty, Uncle Book. You get the first bite, and I'm next. Oh. How could he? Huh? Music? <gasps> Hello. Hey, who are you? Nice <gasps> tune. <laughs> Your musical essence is just what I need to repair my <laughs> instrument. <gasps> <gasps> Interfere, Samurai Ranger! You're not going anywhere with him! Troll! But what's worse is he's not drying out. He must be using a big pool of river water. We need to find him before he hurts anyone else. How are we going to track him down? Well, we won't find him standing around here. <laughs> you were right! So did you get it all on tape? Of course I did. All we have to do is watch this, learn the samurai moves, and soon we'll be fighting monsters just like the rangers. <laughs> um, what does this do, Uncle Bulk? Oh, that's a memory card. You put this in the camera, allows you to record things. Lost it. Oh. Hello. Come on. The owner of the phone is supposed to meet some friends in front of the arena. We can give the phone to them there. <laughs> Come on. Let go of me. to figure out our samurai symbols. I'll do yours. <laughs> Let's see. What do you embody the most? Where's my... 
arms and my legs. That's not you. That's your symbol. A twig. A twig? Don't you get it? The majestic twig can be many great things. Joined together, it can be shelter. Piled high, it can give us warmth as firewood. Even our practice swords are nothing but large twigs. Hmm. <laughs> Thanks, Uncle Walk. Now you do mine. You do mine. What's the matter, Uncle Bulk? The samurai's path. It's elusive. No matter how hard we try, it always seems just out of our grasp. Hmm. Well, maybe we need longer arms. What I'm saying is, perhaps we need to seek another path towards samurai -ness. Let's close our eyes, concentrate, and think on it. <laughs> <laughs> That's it! What? We're gonna recycle old paper? The samurai's warrior instinct must be tempered with an appreciation of art, beauty, and culture. Culture? What, we're gonna make yogurt? No, Spike, we are gonna make music. <laughs> I'm crying in my truck with my hound dog. No pockets for my pants. Oh, but the road goes on forever. Oh, but the road goes on forever. Hey, you! No splashing water in the pool! <laughs> Are you gonna save me or what? Uh, there's a little problem with that. I can't stand up. <laughs> <laughs> About the lady, Spike. When you return this wallet to her, you will give her the thing that every girl wants. A hero. This is your big chance. Imagine her opening her front door. I, uh, I found this. My hero. Snap out of it. But my true heart belongs to the Pink Ranger. But Mia is nice. Hmm. Then let's go! Whoa! Not only is your future girlfriend pretty, but she's rich, too! <laughs> Salad! Monster! Antonio, no! Give me that! Okay! <laughs> You told me to never give up. My hero. I'll never give up thinking you're cute. Ah! I'm sorry. We're not interested in buying anything today. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Is Mia home? Mia? Mm -hmm. She isn't here right now. My popcorn! Huh? Give me that now! Uh, can you wait right there? I'll be right back. Yeah. Who are these guys? Mm -hmm. oh. 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 Spike, 
It's a dojo. <gasps> It's got everything a samurai needs to train. Me probably comes here to train. Hey, maybe they'll train us. Kevin, no! Hey, I was gonna eat that. I need to change. Look at this! What's going on in here? Oh. Well, sir, we we saw the door happen to swing open. After you left. <laughs> and, well, we saw the dojo and we want to sign up. For training lessons. We're samurai in training. There's no training today. Uh, but work hard. We never give up. Never. <sighs> Ever. Ever. I've never seen anyone catch a ball with their face before. <sighs> now let's start sticking together humans! <laughs> He's stuck on spin cycle! Spike! What is that? What is that? Spike! Spike! We'll just wipe it off. Arrow! <laughs> 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 Why'd you bring so many shopping bags with you? Why didn't you? It's half rice donut day. Huh. <gasps> give, give me some of those. Oh, give, me, give me some of those bags. Give me it. Uh, uh. Hey! You're that guy from Mia's Dojo. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Weren't you two supposed to come back? Uh. Oh, 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 oh. My drill sergeant has been waiting to give you a real workout. Uh, yo, you know, we're really busy. We have to, you know, shop. It's very important. Um, yeah. <laughs> what was that? Just some friends of Emily's. <laughs> Vincent. Oh, 
Nice to meet you. I'm Sarah. You probably recognize my name as class president. Oh, no, I'm sorry. It's my first day, actually. First day? Well, you know my name now. Oh, oh, okay. And if you ever forget it, just look at these trophies. Because my name's engraved on every last one of them. Hmm. Dane Romero? Uh, almost everyone. Ah, I see. We share the same hobby. Oh, no, 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 I really don't think ah, you should do that. You can do anything. Ooh. Watch the master at work. That'll do, Monty. We're all finished with the paint booth. So, you're our new instructor. Well, I... Uh... I'm Victor Vincent. Six-pack abs, impeccable teeth. Clearly, your top student. And I've just created a paint job almost as perfecto as I am. Almost. I said almost. Just look at the sleek lines. Check out the sweeping curves. Mm. Mm. Truly, one of a kind. Uh oh. Oh. Now you're three of a kind. One point to the green team. Pfft. Stupid question. No one gives money to their friends. <laughs> Bertie, you can't use your data card. What? Why not? Because you can't. Quiz question two. If I ran for 20 minutes, skipped for 10 minutes, and jumped for three, how long did I work out for? Oh, uh, 33 Earth minutes. Another point for green. So much for teamwork, huh? Question 10. Two and five eighths. Mm. Mm. 27 hours. Washington, D.C. 20 feet. Mm. Ah. Mm. Uh. 12.3 miles. Hold it. Mr. Smarty Pants over there is cheating. Mrs. Finch, I saw the new kid use that thing on his wrist. Is that true, Brody? What is that? thingamajig you have there. It's my data comb. It gives me answers to everything. Oh. Oh. You hear that? Answers to everything. Well, I don't know about your last school, but around here, that's against the rules. I don't want to see that again, okay? But that... Fine. Answers to everything. I never heard such nonsense. <laughs> What's this? That's the new kid's data thingamajiggy. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? That your hair looks spectacular today. No. no. Well, yes, right. but not that. Let me show you. Monty, oh. excuse me. I have a life or death question. How do I become more popular than the Power Rangers? You must defeat a monster in battle. I love the outdoors. It really clears my mind. So I can concentrate on important things, like how I can be more popular. Woo. I need a break, Monty. Me too. <gasps> Showing off my athletic talent has always worked. Yeah, but how do we do it? Monty, is that rock floating in midair? Check it out, Victor. Hey, maybe this is doing it. Maybe if I...
That little crystal makes things completely weightless. I think it's time that Victor Vincent got his 50th trophy. <laughs> Famous? Famous? We've got to get in on this, Monty. It's simple. Sign right here and the whole world can enjoy your stories. What do you say, Redbot? Stop right there. Don't sign anything. <laughs> this contract needs some serious work. For starters, Redbird here will take free oil treatments for life, plus a bonus wax and polish. That does sound nice. Don't worry. As your new managers, we'll get you every dime you deserve. I, uh, made a few notes. No, sorry, this is my first and final offer. Take it or leave it. Well, I, uh... He'll take it. Yippee! This is my lucky day. Welcome to the big time, Redbot. Thank you. Whoa. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh. Got it. Back off. Back off. Ready. Retrieve metal. It worked! <laughs> I can't believe it! That was actually impressive. Wow! Are we geniuses or what? You're right, that is pretty impressive. Uh, watch out, guys. You see, it worked like a dream. <laughs> uh, more like a nightmare. Let's go. So, did anyone else do a project for extra credit? Sarah? Uh. Our new giant magnet will pull in anything. Uh, I'm so excited. Once the Mega Mag helps that weird fox woman destroy Galvanax... We'll be heroes, just as famous as the Power Rangers. <laughs> Is the Mega Mag done? Oh, yes. Just start charging up the capacitor, Madam Omnibus. Odious, you numbskull. Uh, can I get some more alien slop? I'm starving. You can have more slop. <laughs> After this giant ninja steel magnet gets me the Power Stars. So we can destroy Galvanax, right? Exactly. Him and the Power Rangers. Back to work. She's going to destroy the Rangers? I never would have built the Mega Mag if I would have known it would hurt the Rangers. We need to get out of here. But how? I think I have an idea, Monty. You're a genius. We'll dress up as Codabot. Our streaming numbers what, what's are going higher on? than ever before. And we wouldn't be able to do such brilliant work here at Buzz Blast without every one of you. <laughs> but as the boss, I have to think about the future. That's why I've decided to train a new assistant so that eventually they can take my place. Meet my new android. Jborg. Jborg has advanced capabilities. Jay, and I'm sorry to interrupt, but Mr. Lin needs these papers signed right away. Actually, I have an idea. Good morning, Jborg. Good morning, Jay. I need you to sign these papers for me as quickly as you can. Finish! What a mess. Jborg, stack 
back the papers, please? Yeah, of course. Jayborg, that's all. Mm, one moment, please. Mm, Jane, I sent you have great psychic potential. Mm, eat your scarf. Mm, okay. Don't trust your eyes. Closing one sense can open another, so embrace your powers. Thanks, Madam Indigo. Oh, I can feel my powers building in my... No, that is the chili dog I ate. <laughs> Thanks, Madam. Please, sit down, my friends. And we are rolling! Hey, Buzz Blasters. I now have psychic powers and can sense the world around me perfectly. Uh, Jane, the camera's over here. Like I said, perfectly. <laughs> now, with these powers, I'll help the rangers by sensing Sporex to find them. <laughs> They're this way. Keep up, Jay Borg. Excuse me. Jayborg, I need a steady hand to finish my masterpiece. Oh, well, I'm your bot. I've got two. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, Okie dokie. Maddie, good to see ya. Uh, it's Stan. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, Mick? What are you guys doing here? We work here. Okay, well, uh, I was just using Earth's databases to find the prism. You! These computers are for Buzz Blast employees only. Come with me. We're about to roll. Camera set. And action. Welcome to Buzz Blast Live Reviews. And today, we're talking about cats. They offer many things like warmth, companionship, and unconditional love. But they're messy, so it's not worth it. That's why this product was invented, the Catnator 85, a behavior module that allows any android to become a feline friend. Jayborg, would you? Um, will this embarrass me? No, relax. You'll be a cool cat. Seriously, dude? So instead of helping me, you were buying new headphones? Hey, these are noise canceling, solar rechargeable, and they would have sold out. What was wrong with your old ones? What? He said, what was wrong with your old ones? Well, my old ones were, what do you call it? Old. Uh... I'm all about the new tech. I know you get the importance of quality audio for your music, right? This sounds like last week's new phone with a better quality screen. <laughs> and what about your new phone watch? Smart watch, thank you very much. Check it. Well, I think we may have created the most boring Buzz Blast segment ever. 
Javi, I really need you to complete the stories you promise. I'm so sorry, Jane. Ollie was supposed to drop off the samples two hours ago. Is this for the new vegetable hybrid you mentioned? Half pickle, half onion? Yeah, punions. Well, despite the fact that it would change the face of hamburgers as we know it, cancel it. I've got something even more important for you to cover. There's been a strange storm lingering over Pine Ridge Bay all week. The weather people can't determine what's causing it. I want a feature for this afternoon's live stream. Maybe a nice interview with an expert. For real? I'm covering weather? Um, hello. Super awesome weird weather. Get on it. Thanks for having me. What an exciting find. Oh, yes. Well, Purple Bid's very famous in the city, especially for his powerful and mysterious talismans. Oh. Ask her if they're in the chest. Oh, could they be in the chest? Oh, perhaps. We'll find out very soon when we open it for the first time. Ask her if the chest has an ancient pirate's curse. For goodness sake, just wrap it up, G-Borg. So the legend of Purple Beard's talismans lives on for now. <laughs> Thank you, Beatrice. Well, anything for your audience. And we hope you visit us soon. And remember, we run on donations. And cut. Thanks, Miss Cotton. Well, thank you. It was a really fun interview. Sure was. I was listening from back there. Riveting stuff. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> ah! It's Songathon time. Now, give it up for your host, Welcome to the annual Buzz Blast Songathon, where only one talented musician will win the title of Best Original Song. Performers will battle it out in our studio and online, because we're live streaming around the world. Your job is to vote on the Buzz Blast app and help our expert judges decide who wins. Now, give it up for our first performer, Mr. Ed Jones, AKA Pop Pop. are a leaking, I can fix it. If your door is a squeaking, I can fix it. <laughs> now we know why they call him Pop Pop. <laughs> you got this, Pop Pop. Keep going. If your circuits have a flu and you don't know what to do, I can fix that too. <laughs> Mr. Jones, Buzz Blasters will recognize our next contestant. Give it up for Blair Bartlett. Bobby! Oh, I always knew you were special. That's why I'm your manager. You are? I am now. You're gonna be a star. No, you'll be brighter than a star. You'll be like the sun. The sun is a star. Don't ruin the moment, kid. Go, go, go. 